Louise Hodgson is convinced she saw a hare the size of a rodeo surrounded by normal sized hares in a Dorset Valley. Louise, who now runs Sacred Side Tours in Dorset, said she was on the nearby downs when she met a small group of Romani gypsies with some lurcher dogs. She said, We came to a blind valley and it was early September. So it was an unusual sight for that time of year, but there was a group of 10 to 13 hares with what we thought was a deer. But it wasn't, it was a hare the same size as a deer. It was a wonderful experience. It shows there are still some secrets in nature. Louis said the magical experience was in 1976. During a country trek she took from the Cotswolds to Dorset, but the vision has haunted her ever since. She recounted the tale during a question and answer session with Marion Green, 77, at the annual occult conference in Glastonbury Town Hall, in Somerset, which ended yesterday. She said, has anyone else come across that? Marion, who was explaining about magic in the natural world, replied, in the countryside many things happen, the king or queen hares are out there. Related articles call this spot, eight savage hares dumped by the road after being, wildlife call for an end to the slaughter of mountain hares. It was a hare the same size as a deer. It was a wonderful experience. It shows there are still some secrets in nature. Louise Hodgson So are fairies, elemental spirits, or ghosts. If you want things to happen, if you let them happen, they can if you are open to it. Earlier in her talk, Marion had said fairies and sylphs small mythological elf-like creatures, were real. She said, sylphs, and all living beings, are around us. Some want to speak to us again, connect with us again and we can be oblivious to what is going on around us. After the lecture Louise told Express.co.uk she had been near the village of uploaders, near Bridport, in Dorset, when it happened. Asked if she could have actually seen a deer, she said, no, they were proper Romani gypsies, so used to the country and I was used to the countryside. It was a hair with the ears and everything. It was extraordinary. Marion told Express.co.uk she had heard of one other person seeing a gigantic hare in the countryside. Related articles Hares need breeding protection. Hares horror is not over. She said. If you are open to seeing these things, it can happen. According to Dr. Carl Schuker, a cryptozoologist, who is aware of Louise's sighting, it is not the only one, but there have been more sightings of giant rabbits. Cryptozoologists research the existence of mythical creatures and if extinct species are still alive. Dr. Shuka said there have been two giant rabbit sightings in Banbury, Oxfordshire, and another one in Felton, Northumbria. In a blog post, he also said there have been many giant rabbit and hare sightings in Ireland since the 1970s. However, he is not convinced there is anything supernatural about the sightings. In a blog post on his website, he said large rabbit sightings are likely to be escaped domesticated large species such as the Flemish giant, the continental giant, which can grow up to 55 pounds and the size of a cocker spaniel.
related articles latest snap shows there could be more than one Loch Ness Monster RC Monsters real. Loch Ness Monster-like creature filmed. He added, but what of the king hares? The British Isles is home to two indigenous species of hare. The most common, widespread, and familiar of these is the brown hare Lepus europaeus. One of the world's largest species of hare, it can attain a body length of up to 30 inches, plus a tail length of up to 6 inches, which means that individuals at the upper end of this species size range can be as much as 3 feet, and can weigh up to 11 pounds, I. E. As big as a decent sized dog. As many people do not realize that hares in Britain can attain such notable dimensions, the sight of an exceptionally large hare coupled perhaps in some cases with less than accurate size estimation skills on the part of its observer may be sufficient to create a king hare. Moreover, there might be individual hares possessing a mutant gene that expresses extra-large body size, or even suffering from a hormonal imbalance that results in gigantism, comparable to various endocrinologically based conditions recorded from humans. Related articles Man claims this drawing is of a real yeti he saw and sketched before reading its mind Bigfoot on Mars. Alien hunters make shock claim of Yeti skull find shocking footage, mythical ape man caught on camera.